every year the examiner's report in A-level physics identifies a common mistake and that is show questions. Some even say that the examiners were finding it difficult to award marks because the candidate's work was disorganized. So as an example let's use our knowledge of physics to show that the density of nuclei is independent of the nucleon number. As I come across a show question I subconsciously tell myself that it is not the answer that the question is after but my working out and I'm going to try and start from as fundamental as I can and then I'm going to keep it structured until I reach the final result. The density of a nucleus is just equal to the total mass of the nucleus and all of its constituents divided by the total volume of the nucleus. Hmm, well what is the total mass equal to? If there are A nucleons this will be equal to A times the mass of each individual nucleon. Please note that this derivation assumes that the mass of a proton is about equal to the mass of a neutron which is, let, in this case I'm just going to call it M. For instance if I had something like helium 4 then its total mass will just be equal to 4 times the mass of an individual nucleon. Okay what about the volume? Well the volume we can assume that the atom, the nucleus to be spherical so this will be 4 thirds pi r cubed. But remember we have a formula for the radius of a nucleus so we're going to have a m and then 4 thirds pi. What was the formula for the radius of a nucleus? It's going to be r naught a to the power of a third. But hang on a minute, look at this. a to the power of 1 over 3 cubed will end up cancelling so my final step will just be to show the actual cancellation are not cubed a to the power of just one and this here will end up cancelling out. And this is why the density of a nucleus is independent of the nucleon number. Now this as a skill set is really important but it's not the complete picture. And this is precisely why you should have a look at this question for a little bit of more of extra practice to ensure that you get maximum chances for a good grade right over here.